Hi, Rick from Papa Bear Racing here, and today we're out to review a new wrench organizer by people called Alien Space Saver, so stay tuned. <laughs> Okay, today we're out in the shop, which is really my garage since I don't own a shop anymore. This first box is a Husky box and it's pretty darn near full. Over here I've got a little top box from Craftsman that was my first one at 17. And then next to it I've got a snap-on top and bottom unit that I bought over 42 years ago and it still works great for me. I love this box. And next to that I've got a Craftsman top box on top of a first generation US general bottom box. So recently my pops passed away and my my dad was kind of a amateur mechanic who was never super good but he had a lot of wrenches that he he gave to me. So I gave some to my son and I kept what ones I didn't have. Obviously I have a lot that needs to be cleaned up and organized. I wasn't happy with the current system I'd been using you can see all the different types of wrench holders I've tried. So I went online and I looked for something to keep my wrenches in better shape, keep them aligned properly. And I found a really cool product. They were magnetic. They stuck to the bottom of your drawer. They had a little orange thing that told you if a wrench was missing. I thought, wow, this is cool. And then I saw the price. Wow, these were cost prohibitive. If you want to put a hundred wrenches together, man, it was going to cost you a lot of money. So then I saw where they had another product called the DIY product. And this was more for people who didn't want to spend the money, but still wanted to organize their toolbox. I said, okay, I'll go ahead and try one. So I ordered up some and they came in the mail and I opened them up and I was very disappointed. The quality was really poor. So the quality was just not there. They were little plastic things that clipped together and I clipped a bunch together and they cupped like this. They were, you know, like made a curve. I put some weight of wrenches in it and it kind of flattened out a little bit, but not all the way. So I knew that they had a 90 day return policy. So I wrote them an email asking for a RMA so I could return them. They sent me back a snotty little email saying, duh, that's why the, the parts are so inexpensive. They're not gonna be the quality of our regular product. And didn't sit well with me. So she gave me instructions of how to return the product, which I did. It cost me $15.50 to mail it back, but they were really good and they honored the warranty and they did refund my money. Then I figured, okay, what are my alternatives? And I saw a video on YouTube about a guy talking about the alien space saver system. And I went ahead and ordered it. What it is, is these two quarter inch rods of aluminum with these plastic things that clamp on and you can space them out however you need to fit your wrenches. And what it'll do is it'll free up so much space in, in your toolbox you won't believe it. Before we go too much further, let me say I'm not sponsored by anybody. I'm not getting paid for this. I just want to share what I found to be an excellent system. So let's go ahead and, and take a look. Okay, I got one section kind of cleared. Um, where I can at least put the wrenches down, I'm going to have to do something with the liner in the drawers. But So when I got my uh, packet from Alien Space Savers, um, obviously the thing was a little long, so I thought, well, I'll go ahead and cut them with a hacksaw and make them fit. Well, I hacked and hacked off the hacksaw, and what it did is the rods got hot, and uh, I got kind of frustrated and I kind of bent them. Anyhow, I was able to use the rest of the parts that came to go ahead and start setting up my toolbox. Well, in the meantime, I went on the website, got the contact information, and sent an email off to them and said, Hey, what do you guys use to cut the rods to make them fit? I used a hacksaw and it got hot and I bent the crap out of it. I didn't really expect much of a reply, but I did get a reply. I got a response within 24 hours and the guy told me, hey, I use my cutoff wheel. I'm like, well, duh, why didn't I use my cutoff wheel? But he said, I'm going to go ahead and send you a couple replacements. I thought, wow, what kind of customer service is this? So I went ahead and ordered up enough to finish up the toolbox altogether. I was impressed with both the product and with the customer service. Okay, after a long time cutting and fitting 
and working around the heavy bag in the garage in order to get to the drawers, I want to show you my finished product. Top drawer. These are my metric wrenches. I can't believe how well organized they are and how much room I have. I may actually have to go ahead and buy some more metric wrenches. This is the main SE, SAE drawer that I work out of. It's got my snap-on, it's got my ratcheting, it's got some of the Craftsman stuff. Um, look how easily stuff fit in there. Even if it was different manufacturers, I was able to adjust laying down some wrenches while the other ones stood up. But look at what a fantastic job that is. I may have to get some more wrenches to go in here. And then this is kind of my catch-all. These are the weird wrenches. These are the ones that have open end on one end and a socket on the other end. I was able to flip them back and forth so that the socket was at each end and able to fit them in there. I was also able to get my open end wrenches in there, laying down when I needed to. I was also able to get the little skinny ignition wrenches. And I was able to get the long box ends that are super thick. So I'm very happy with this. Now I had some extra stuff and I thought, what am I going to do with it? Well, it's kind of hard to see in here, but what I did is I started putting a uh, my scrapers in these as well. I've got uh, weird gasket scrapers. I've got paint scrapers. Um, I think I'm going to add a few more of those things and, and put the rest of these scrapers in there too. I think there's a lot of different uses other than just wrenches I can come up with for these things. Okay, time for final analysis. What do I think? Well, I think that the Alien Space Saver is a really inexpensive, high quality solution for not just home guys like me, but I think for pro mechanics. Back when I owned my own shop, I would have loved to have this product because you have people sneaking into your toolbox and you don't know if something's missing. This way you can tell if your tools are missing. Um, yeah, I think it's a really good product. I would have to give it two thumbs up. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely be buying more of it. I think there's some unique ways you can use it too. I think you don't have to just use it for wrenches. Uh, screwdrivers looks like a, an option. Uh, you saw my scraper drawer. I think I'm gonna go ahead and get that built out. Um, my sockets, I don't know. They do offer a socket product and I'm thinking about maybe ordering some of those and doing a review on those in the near future.